Okay, I haven't put up a cooking video in a while. I'm gonna do a quick presentation today of something I threw together, and I'm gonna title this little video vlog. I put these little cooking videos under my vlog category, you know, because uh, sometimes I'll play a song and that'll go under either my country covers, unless it's an original song, something I made, and I'll put it under my original. So, but anyhow, it's been quite a while. Like I said, I really ain't been doing a lot, but uh, trying to get a little rest, and I really ain't been playing much guitar. But tonight, I got my guitar here, so my plan is real quick. I'm going to show you what I cooked up real fast. And like I said, I'm going to name this video uh, something titled Michigan because we got Michigan ingredients in this. Because you know I'm in southern Michigan, for all, I, all of you out there uh, who might not know. But anyway, I'm going to show you the food real quick. And I'll play a quick little something real fast. I'm not going to play a whole song. It's going to be a short video. Um, I don't know. I might have a week. I might be able to jump on. I don't know. I've kind of got an idea to like throw together a song. Um, if I could get the time to work on it. Uh, I'm thinking of trying to build something quick. Uh, I got an idea. Actually, a buddy of mine started it. Gave me the idea quite a few years back. But... Uh, He's passed on now, he's no longer around, and I actually got, I've got pieces of the song that I'm going to try to build on it, and uh, it might come out pretty good, and if it does, I mean, he don't, he'd only be all the more happy, but, uh, so I'm going to get back to what I cooked today, and I'll play a little something, but we'll get out of here, like I said, this is January 27th, 2024, uh, so I just want, I got the idea to do this cooking video, because I got hungry here, it's a little late. And I made myself a venison burger. And then I got my my drink out of the fridge to go with it. And that gave me the idea. I'm like, oh, I got me a little, uh, little, gave me the idea to do like a little uh, cooking video with some Michigan ingredients. Like I said, once again. So here we go. So this is what I did with my burger. This is a venison burger out of the dough. And what I did is, because I'm probably going to share it. I seasoned this up and I put onion actually in the burger and I put my season in the burger that way it don't collect and get all built up on the pan and um, but I laid my jalapeno on top of the burger and I melted cheese on I, you see I only put the jalapeno on one half the burger because it's gonna be so good that uh, somebody else I'm sure is gonna want to try some of it and I didn't want to you know everybody don't like peppers but and then for the condiments, what I did here, uh, I'll grab that burger in a minute, but what I did is I just did a little mayonnaise, a little bit of steak sauce, a little bit of ranch, some generic called Kroger Ranch, and then I did a little bit of a little splash of open pit, and then here's what we're going to do. Now I'm going to, okay. They better not come up here in the room. I gotta grab my spatula real quick. Hold on. All right, so I might act like I know what I'm doing here. Here's the thing, though. I've been working myself around the kitchen for quite a long time, so I do kind of know what I'm doing. It's just like uh, this. I, I I never attended no culinary school or nothing, so you know. So here we go. Oh, and then the other thing is, I'm using an artesian bun. Got it. There's no seeds on it. Oh my goodness. All right, hold on. So, so here's my idea about making this. This is why this is gonna be a Michigan cooking video with Michigan ingredients because you got your venison, which my little cousin, Donnie the Third, AKA Fred Bear, that's like how the 20th deer he slaughtered this year. Well, he had permits for them all coming off a farm and whatnot, so it's all legal. Uh, it's a dough. So, we're, I'm going to put a, I got onion inside the burger, but I'm going to put some fresh onion on it. Got it? So, man, I might be able to open my own restaurant. I'm, I got to come up with a good name for it, though, if I did. I think I'm that good. I hate to toot my own horn, but, uh, ah. I thought about it a long time ago. I was like, if I had a restaurant, I'd just call it Fat Boys. You know? So, I'm going to put a little tomato on it. And then, 
This is why, like I said, once again, this is a Michigan ingredient cooking video because here you got it. You got your venison from Michigan and you got your burners from Michigan. Good old burners. And this black cherry burners is the shit. So I gotta remember my peppers are on this side. So look at this thing. <laughs> so let's bring it up. So you got your peppers over here. So that when I cut it in half, somebody don't get a bunch of peppers. And I, this is how I make my burgers. Uh, they're probably they're at least a quarter pound. So uh, my uncle Marvin used to make them huge, like as big as your hand when he fried burgers. But uh. Pretty, looks pretty decent. I ain't got no size with it today, I'm sorry, but I guess I can cut into it. It's a mess, so damn it. Let's see how she comes out. This 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 artesian bread just I wish I could have toasted it. But here we go. Let's open her up. And I didn't make I didn't make her medium. And I don't know if you can see it, but you see I put onion in the burger. I put my season in my onion. You got, I got onion right in the burger too. So once again, here's your Michigan home cooked meal. It's all you need in life is that venison burger and a good cold burners. That's my substitute from the uh, the original drink that I grew up drinking, which was probably Paps and Miller, Black Label. Alright, so I'll just run through something real fast, nothing, nothing, nothing crazy. Hopefully my phone don't stop. I'll play a little bit of a, a little bit of a redneck anthem song, I guess. And I guess I'm kind of rednecky, if you could say that, I don't know. But bear with me on it, if I mess it up, oh well. I'm a, I'm a guy that's never really ashamed to embarrass myself, so. Well, I ain't rich, but I damn sure want to be. Working like a dog all day and working for me. I wish I had a rich uncle that kicked the bucket. I was sitting on a pile like Warren Buffett. They say money can't buy everything But it could buy me a boat It could buy me a truck to pull it It could buy me a Yeti 110 eyes down with some silver bullets Yeah, and I know what they say Money can't buy everything But maybe so you could buy me a boat They call me redneck White trash And blue collar I trade all that For a couple million dollars Yeah, I know they say That the money is the root of all evil Can't stare the camel Through the eye of a needle That all may be true But it still sounds pretty It could buy me a boat It could buy me a truck to pull it It could buy me a Yeti 110 ice down with some silver bullets Yeah, I know what they say Honey can't buy everything But maybe so It could buy me a boat Alright, that's all I'm doing with that Don't stop it yet, I gotta I would do a taste test of this thing, but uh, you know it's going to be kind of sloppy. But I bet you this is going to be one good burger here. And uh, But I will take a toast to Michigan and all you. And if you guys ain't in Michigan, sorry. Because, you know, our politics are jacked and our price of living is really bad, but we got some good woods and water here. Oh. And they do truck this out of some states, so you get in the grocery store, get you some of that. All right, later.